Hey everybody, Montague here, and welcome back to Maze. Now last time we were told to hit the showers, and that's just what we're gonna do. Oh, we also we also made a teddy bear that speaks Russian. His name is Vladdy. And he's pretty nice. He's a cool dude. But anyway, without without any further distractions, let's just let's just go and get right to the showers. Come on, Vladdy. Oh my god. This might take a while. Come on! Vladdy! Vlad! Walk faster! Jesus, can I pick him up? I feel like I need him for stuff. Oh my god. Okay, screw it, Vladdy. You're on your own. Sorry, you were a part of this team, and now, now you're not. Oh, I think he teleports when I walk too far away. Oh god! Oh god, Vladdy! What kind of demonic bear are you? Leave me alone! Vladdy's the real horror of this game. Stay here Whoa. while you do your stupid things, idiot. Okay, I don't know what just happened. I like teleported in here. Why am I going in here when the bear is so tiny he could fit in here easily? The game wants me to go that way. It's obviously a trap. I'm gonna check out this way. Very dark. All right. Well, nothing over there. I wish I could sprint. Who drew a line all the way through here? Was it Bob? Seems like something Bob would do, but I think he's too fat to do this. Well, this game, wow, there's just a dead end. This is this is a poorly built facility. A yellow line. Oh, where does it lead? It's okay, I'm just gonna keep following the red line. All right. Nope, nope, did not mean to press space. Always think I can jump, always forget. I wish I could sprint though. Come on, you can slide down this. Wait, why are there two yellow lines? What happens What happens if I follow the yellow line? Ooh. Oh! <gasps> where did it go? Who are you? Not here. Ha! Not here. So insulting! How dare it! This insolence will not be tolerated! This one is dangerous. Not like the others. I can see it already. This one has a brain. Hmm, must be dealt with. Who the fuck are you? Are you the weird cousin? <laughs> oh god. I think we found our villain. I think he's also kind of stupid. He's probably talking about you. No, he's not! He doesn't even know I exist. No one knows I exist. Uh, I would go check the other yellow line, but... It's a little far back, and I don't really feel like it. I'm lazy. All right, let's go. Come on. Oh, it's getting dark. Am I gonna run into the villain now? Oh, hello, princess. Wow, corn can really snore. She's got Christmas lights on her. Yes? Who has disturbed me? It is me. We are not amused that you have kept hero. us waiting. As our servant informed you of your task. Oh. No, of course not. Imbecile. No matter. One must do things themselves if one would like it done right. Yes? Feels like we have been trapped here for an age. Our cowardly captors saw to that. By stopping the righteous light from bathing us in its glory. Of course, we would not expect one such as yourself to understand. I'm calling it the twist of this game is I am corn. But perhaps you are different from the rest. Dare we let ourselves hope that we have finally found our champion? God, she pauses a lot. No, likely not. Stop pausing. But we would be remiss oh if we did God. not at least let you attempt to do something of value. So, we bequeath to you your tasks. Restore energy to this wretched place once again. And raise the rings. Only then will you be worthy of consideration. Oh, those rings. Okay, okay, I got it. Looks like you have something to do. In pure coincidence, a new path is open to you. Head West Hook Checkpoint. Wait, I want to go down there. 
Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and call it, guys. I am corn, 100%. I am a corn stock. That can hold things. It explains why I don't have feet. It explains why I'm in a cornfield. It explains nothing else, really. Well, it does. It's, it explains why I'm stupid. That's also something it explains. Cause I'm a big old dum dum. All right, let's see here. Here's the other yellow path. Let's see where this takes me. What's in here? Ooh, getting all spooky. It should be me. It should be me. But it's me. Surrounded by idiots, rattle, underappreciated, ridiculed, scorned. Really, what is that? X is not a number. What? Why is that there? <laughs> we should have kept one around to ask about that. X is ugh, ridiculous. Uh oh. Uh oh. So he's definitely murdered oh, people. Better. Some of my best work. Was it saying something? What was I doing? Ah oh, yes, dealing with unwanted guests. Me? I'm not unwanted. I'm not an unwanted guest. He does seem not. I feel like he's just misunderstood. Let's light him on fire. That's what I vote on. The real, the real terror in this game, though, is fucking Vlad, the teleporting Russian bear. I mean, holy shit. I don't even want to go back here. Save me from Vlad. Oh god. Hello, Vlad. Are you doing, like, the Nazi salute? Let me out! Ah, idiot! So you are done being stupid up there. Good. Where we go? I hate you, Vlad. I mean, you're cute and all, but I hate you. Oh, I need- how do I uncrouch? How do I uncrouch? Oh, there we go. <laughs> I'm stupid. Alright. Let's see here. What is next? It said the West Hall? Oh, I bet that's over here. Okay. Ugh. Ugh, he just- oh god! Go away, Vlad! Stop teleporting, you're an abomination! Useless garbage everywhere! Yes, yes, it is. It is useless garbage. It's useless garbage. So boy, what a mess! Is this place where all the garbage come from? <laughs> oh, Vlad, you're one to talk. You are garbage. I'm just kidding, that was mean. I'm sorry, Vlad. Open, open. What the fuck? Where do I go? It said... No, not there either. Hang on, hang on, we're gonna find this. There's nothing in there. I don't think there is a path over here. Ooh, okay, yes there is. West Hook checkpoint. Oh god, we're going downstairs now. Vlad, come with me! You need to go first. Can Vlad even climb stairs? Oh god, yes he can. Oh god, why would we go downstairs? Seems like a bad idea. What? Why is that Vladi's job? What is Vladi supposed to do? Listen, you are a communist. You fix this for free. That's how it works. And if you do a good job, I'll give you a sweaty headband. This stupid thing will never work. It is... Huh? <laughs> okay. Oh. So, I need... Boom and... Boom. Okay, so I guess that's supposed to fool big corn guy. This coat rack in front of camera. Ah. Ah, headband. Oh, and now I use the face. There we go. Ah, you look great. A perfect representation of Bob. Yes, definitely. I mean, you could use a haircut, but other than that, I think we did a good job. Good job, Vladdy. You must be joking. That never worked. Well, that was still stupid. I agree, Vladdy. You know what, Vladdy? I think we're gonna get along after all. I was worried at first, but now... Now I see your value. Hey, look, you opened a door. I'm smart! Oh, God. There's so much to explore. I just don't know if it's worth it. I keep... I'm, I'm half expecting still for there to be, like, some horror aspect to this game. Ah, uh, okay. 
You know, I don't know why I try to go off the beaten path. It's a pretty straightforward game. There hasn't been any benefit to actually, like, going off the path. So I'm just going to stick to it from now on. But I'm still expecting this game to jump into a horror feel. I mean, it's definitely got the environments for horror. It's just not really scary. Ooh, I can go upstairs now. Thank God, I hated being downstairs. It was creepy and gross. It's a lot of wasted floor space. I'm not going to lie. There's like 10 flights here. Submarine access. Sounds like my kind of access. Well, at least we haven't escaped. Why is there an ocean? Oh, hey, Vladdy. Why is there an ocean just like right by farmland? I'm pretty sure I didn't see that when I was in the house. This, I don't know how far we got. Okay, what's this? This magic water pipe grants you the power to transport water from one end of it to the other. There will be no reason for you to do this at any point in this adventure, but you will continue to carry it anyways, just in case. All right, sounds like me in any adventure game. Here we go. Hiya, Ted. Just FYI, I brought the acetylene gas? I don't know, acetylene gas tank up to the farm for an annual staff barbecue. Completely corn free, of course. Ha ha ha. Bob. <laughs> oh my god, you're eating my people. Bob, how many times have I told you that we can't have barbecues on the farm? Put it back. We're days behind schedule and stop joyriding with the tractor, dummy. Cordially, Ted. That is sure cordial, considering how much he hates Bob. Alright, so now I got a key. Where am I gonna take this key? Actually, let's take a look at it. It's a shame you don't have small hands, as handling this key would be much easier. It looks like the key for a toolbox lock, which could be useful if you can manage to find the fine motor skills needed to operate such a small instrument. I'm telling you guys, I'm corn. It's 100%. <laughs> Why? Created by Pete's Games and Carnival. The design of a loading crane appears to be based off a simple claw game, a fact which excited Bob to no end. Ted, conversely, wasn't too thrilled about it, but was stuck with it anyways after Bob forged his signature on the approval form. Wow. Good job, Bob. I like Bob. I feel like I'd get along with Bob in real life. Hey, butter. Bloody's favorite. Yeah, you don't like butter? Oh, hang on, I gotta read the right letter first. Hey, it's Ted. I upgrading the lifting system to two people so two people can use it at once. Our efficiency will nearly double. Bob, know that I do not say this lightly, but this may well be the absolute worst idea you've ever had, idiot. Cordially, Ted. I feel like at some point, at some point, Ted's gonna actually have a good idea. Hang on. A oh, cello case. Monty Muffin, open it. Vlad, open it. You have a claw. Damn it. A sealed box. Can I really not open a sealed box? Okay, whatever. Hey, you Ted. Need this box of knickknacks loaded. Be a pal and move it for me, would ya? Bob, you sloth. I'm not your errand boy. Load it yourself, cordially, Ted. All right, well, I don't think there's anything else to do in this room. Let's see here. Stupid American garbage. Well, that's not good. That doesn't bode well. Locker DF-48. An instruction manual for building your very own two-man submarine. Since Bob and Ted opted for the budget model, the manual is 800 pages long and mapped out in a fashion that is similar to Choose Your Own Adventure novel. Oh, boy. I think I know what happened to Bob. Ah, here we go. Although it doesn't... I don't... Open, please. Hiya, Ted. Since this is a highly sensitive area, I added a new security door. No need to thank me. Can't be too careful, Bob. Bob, you do realize that your new security door closes for no reason and locks people inside this very secure area. Stop being cheap and get a door that works, moron. Wait, so now Bob's the... or Ted... Bob's the cheap one? What? Has Bob always been cheap? I don't know what that is, but I bet it's in the chill case. Or the box. Can I smash the chill case open with a hammer? Ah! Nope. Can I cut it open? No. I'm gonna use the box cutter on the box. How boring. Of course. Faberge eggs. Why you pick eggs? up so much garbage, idiot? Bloody does not understand. Why? Why is this here? Don't question things. I just do them because I'm in a video game, Vladdy. Place priceless fragile. Ugh. Fragile. 
I can't speak tonight. Yeah, take that, priceless. Egg with hammer for some reason. I don't know what I just picked up. Priceless lockpick. Why do I have a lockpick? Okay, well that's obviously, is this really gonna, oh wait, no. Cello cases are locked. But bam them! There we go. The most expensive lockpick in history to unlock a cello case. But now I got plutonium. Vladdy won't say this, but he probably could crawl through the vat or the vent and unlock the door. Thanks, Vlad. I don't know what I have here, but it looks radioactive, and I think I'm getting cancer. In there? Oh, butzo boy. Yeah, go, Vladdy. Go. Stupid idiot, making Vladdy crawl through dumb thing. Hey, what is Vladdy hey. supposed to do in here? I crawled through a vent Stupid. earlier this episode. <gasps> Stupid wires everywhere. Why Don't complain. Oh, God. Uh, why is this stupid thing upside down? Why couldn't I crawl no through sense. that vent? That's a pretty big How vent. How stupid are these idiots? Maybe if Vladdy gets... Oh, ah, Vladdy has to... Oh, I can't do this stuff. Ah, ah, boy, I so many... Jesus. Hey, idiot. Did that work? Stop being stupid and say something. Yep. Fine. Vladdy done anyway. Two more Lushy drugs. Stupid idiot. Could get nowhere without Vladdy. Vladdy has to do everything. You're damn so, right. Now what? Okay, so I couldn't crawl through there. All right. All right, whatever. So why do I have this radio? <laughs> you know, I, probably... I forgot to read that. Someone read that to me. Anyway. Well, I think we completed a lot this episode. And I'm pretty happy with it. I got my radioactive thing. I still have Monty Muff. I've got Vladdy. I think we've made progress. So I'm gonna end the episode here, guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you want to keep up to date with all my content, you can hit that subscribe button. Yada, 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 in screen stuff. Until next time, everyone. My name is Montague, and I'll see you around.